Pizza is a vegetable, and Lucky Charms are better for you than steak. I wish I was kidding, but this is how out of hand the food industry marketing has gotten. Since 1994, marketing claims on healthy food have been the same. This has allowed several food companies to label processed, unhealthy food as healthy, with a widening range of buzzwords to persuade you to think you're making healthy decisions. An estimated 40% of people still consider these bogus buzzwords when they shop, but hopefully soon, this will change. As of last September, the US FDA proposed an updated criteria for how foods can be labeled with the nutrient content claiming healthy on their packaging. This the proposed rule would align the definition of healthy with the current nutrition science, the updated nutrition facts label, and the current dietary guidelines for Americans. Hopefully this proceeds as 75% of people are not eating enough fruits and vegetables, 63% of people are eating too much sugar, 90% of people are exceeding sodium limits, while diabetes and obesity continue to skyrocket. However, the food industry is fighting back. Just a few months after this proposal, Tufts University presented the new food guide pyramid, where frosted mini wheats and chocolate covered almonds are in the top 10 recommended foods, with Lucky Charms being better for you than ground beef. Oh, by the way, this nonsense took three years to develop and costed millions of taxpayer dollars. And now companies that control a majority of the processed foods you're eating are claiming this proposal to be unconstitutional as they argue it violates their first amendment rights of corporate free speech. They're probably upset this would exclude 95% of their cereals and a majority of their snacks, baked goods, pastas, and frozen pizzas.